Hi everyone. We are going into the lesson parts of GE90 Turbofane engine. This engine is the most commercialized engine utilized for Boeing and Airbus. The major units of GE90 Turbofane engine are forward spinner or hub, fan blades, inner acoustic panel, fan stator module, low pressure compressor, high pressure compressor, dual dome annular combustor, low pressure turbine and high pressure turbine. General Electric 90 is a turbofane engine designed for thrust growth, engine commonality for the 777 airplane family, fuel efficiency, 180 minute etops, low emissions, low noise, reduced operating cost. We are going to discuss about individual parts of turbofane GE90 engine. Now talking about GE90 fan blade. 22 composite wide cord blades and platforms, large fan diameter for higher air mass flow. Fan geared, reduces fan tip speed thus producing less noise. Low tip speed and pressure ratio for quiet efficient operation. Wide cord composite fan, high performance and low weight. Environmental resistance. G90 fan material system displays equal environmental resistance like those of current aircraft composites. Actual blade fully protected by polyurethane coating. No exposure to ultraviolet radiation. Next talking about G90 low pressure compressor. Compact engine construction. Rugged, low aspect ratio with oils. Reduced part count. Reduced operating cost. Short LPC boost to minus 3 stages. LPC pressure ratio around 1.10 to 1.14. Low LPT entry temperatures for thrust growth. Up next about GE90 high pressure compressor. 10 stage HPC with 23 to 1 pressure ratio. Next talking about combustor. Dual dome annular combustor from successful advanced military programs. Reduced NOx emission levels as low as 10 ppm. Reduced unburned hydrocarbon, carbon monoxide and smoke levels. Improved operability. Long life liner construction. Dome aerothermal tuned for power setting. Altitude relight capability 30,000 feet which is 9.144 km with margin. Next talking about turbine unit. High pressure turbine incorporates proven design technology. Six stage LPT and two stage HPT. Stiff, simply supported rotor system like CFM56 for dynamic stability. Boltless assembly of oil and shroud cooling circuits modeled after successful CF6-80 design. Introduces film cool technology from proven turbine experience. Multi-hole turbine cooling technology, better cooling effectiveness. Successful CF6-80 designs and passive clearance control system features. Stage 1 HPT blade casting with laser drilled cooling hole pattern. Stage 2 HPT blade with laser drilled cooling hole pattern. Modular nozzle assemblies based on CFM56 and CF6-80 designs. Thank you all.